The celebration continues in Brookings as SDSU, the number six seed in the NCAA women's basketball tournament. The high school basketball season came to a close on Saturday with the state tournaments, meaning it's time to start unveiling our Sanford Pentagon Kelloland Media Group Player of the Year nominees. This week, we'll spotlight the five girls nominees, and we begin with Ethan Senior Carly Gustafson. The wrestlers, six foot forward, tallied nearly 1,900 points and 800 rebounds during her storied career and played in five straight state B tournaments. Ethan fell one win shy of a perfect season and the program's second state championship, but Gustafson enjoyed the experience. We had a fun ride just with all of our teammates and our coaches. I think the best part about the season was just making memories with them and yeah we came up short that last game but I just think it was just the ride was fun. It was an awesome journey and you know there's some things you can't control you can't control injuries sometimes you can't control how well the other team shoots and, and you got to give Dismet credit you know for beating us that night but you know, we had our adversity even in that game. The Rustlers lost senior point guard Maddie Miller to a knee injury early in the championship game. We'll take a closer look at Carly Gustafson's past, present, and future tonight at 10. We'll unveil the player of the year coming up at the All-Star Banquet on Saturday, March 30th. Kenyon Martin, the former number one overall pick in the NBA back in 2000, will be the keynote speaker. We'll have uh, all that coming up as part of the celebration of the All-Star Weekend. Banquet is scheduled for 7 o'clock on March 30th and is free and open to the public. Reporting live from Brookings, Travis Fossing, Kettleland Sports. We'll be right back.